But you know how like when you tell fishing stories, you're supposed to add the extra 10%? Well, every time I add the extra 10% or the extra 5 inches, she's like, no, that's not how, what happened. No, that's not how the story goes. No, no, he's wrong. Alright, so I'm on a mission. I just got home from the beach. And Samantha let it be known that I, she needs a kayak crate. So I'm out here trying to make one. I got an old milk crate that's probably 30 years old. And it was in the garage. And it's about to get requisitioned for a kayak crate. Check it out. It's right there. It's old. So, here we go. Check it out, it literally took like 10 minutes to make this thing. Boom, now I just gotta clip the zip ties off of it. And it's gonna be awesome. Get out, all the way around. I really didn't have the right size PVC for this. It'll work for the inshore rods, but not for the big rods, because the pipe is too thin. Check it out, I need the bigger pipe. But I just had this laying around, and I need something for like tomorrow. So I put these together, and she never has more than three rods anyway, so that'll work until I get some bigger PVC pipe. There's some laying around here somewhere. Literally, the trick to these things is zip ties and get weird with it. You can zip tie like 900 different ways, and as long as it's sticking in there, you're good to go. I've yet to have a King Mac or rip one of those things off. That's if you got the drag set right. I'll show you what's going on here. Clearing out everything. Trying to get everything organized for this weekend. Yeah. It's coming though. It's coming though. Gonna put all this back in here. Really organized. Got the kayak all ready to go. I'm going to get the yellow kayak out. I gotta give the yellow kayak a name. What, what should I name the yellow kayak? I really don't have a name for the the white kayak. So I gotta come up with some names. So that's what I got going on there. Yellow kayaks around here and I made Samantha a, a crate. It's a very awful crate. I'm not gonna lie. It's, it's an awful crate but it's gonna work for this weekend. And then when I find some bigger PVC pipe for it, it'll work better. But until then, it's gonna work. So I got everything packed in the yellow kayak here. So yeah, I basically put everything in the hatch. That way I don't forget it. I got the paddle, the seat in there, I'll put the life jacket in there. And working on my flotation skills here. Also, it's like 96 degrees here, hence why I shaved my entire head again, because it's freaking hot. And the mosquitoes are everywhere. But, I got the old crate here. Check it out. With the, uh, See, so yeah, I got the wrong type of pipe. That's the only thing I had laying around. It's from an old high jump from karate, because we used to teach karate, and don't need those high jumps anymore. You know what you jump over, practice jumping over? So I cut them up. And I think this is, what, three quarter inch, and I need the bigger one, so it'll fit this handle. So, and I gotta clip the little black things off there. The tie straps. But it's ready to go. Also, I'm cooking grilled chicken. Check it out, it looks phenomenal. Woo! It's gonna be good. So it's gonna be a good weekend. Going to the snorkel reef tomorrow. Uh, we got a whole good good group coming. Got a couple veterans that were uh, that are subscribers that wanted to go out. They're going out with me, and it's gonna be awesome. So watch watch tomorrow's vlog. Watch tomorrow's vlog. All right, I'm in introducing chicken salad. Check it out. Chicken salad. Yeah. It's gonna be amazing. It's gonna be an amazing day on the water to come back to chicken salad. Samantha says I don't narrate properly. No, he doesn't. We're not coming back to it to the house. We're eating it on the beach. She's fact checking me. Fact. Fact. But you know how like when you tell fishing stories, you're supposed to add the extra 10%? Well, every time I add the extra 10% or the extra five inches, she's like, no, that's not how, what happened. No, that's not how the story goes. 
No, no, he's wrong. Also, she just gave me the dirty eye because she's standing right there. Yeah, dirty eye. Mm. They're done. They're absolutely done, and they're delicious. Shh, don't tell Samantha. They're really good. They are. They're really good. And she found out that I ate one. She counted them. Also, I just tried the chicken salad, and I could literally eat it with a shovel. <laughs> Like, if not a shovel, a bulldozer, just open my mouth and shove it. I could literally eat it with my hands. I could eat it with my hands. Check these out. Pretty awesome.